What if I moved that over to Monday? Oh, but then Mr. Zawa will be mad that that assignment's late. Hmm. Oh, hey, new kid. I didn't hear you come in. Oh, I remember your name. I just think new kid sounds a little more affectionate, you know? <laughs> you have this class, or are you just looking for me? <laughs> it's okay, you don't have to be shy. You do remember me, right? I'm Mina, Mina Ashido. I help design your hero costume. I mean, you didn't you didn't forget me, right? I put a lot of time into that, and I felt like we had had like a little bit of like a connection. Oh, oh, good, 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 good. <laughs> I thought so. Uh, are you liking your costume? Oh, good, good, good. And how are you liking UA? Yeah, it's pretty great here. Everyone's pretty nice. They can be a little hardworking though, and a little rambunctious if you know what I mean. <laughs> anyway. It's so cool that you're in this class. We'll get to spend more quality time together. It has been a while since I've seen you. What's new? Oh, sorry. I'll keep my voice down. What's new? Any, like, new friends that you've made? Any new, like, crushes, maybe? Yeah, like, did you see anyone that you like or that you fancy or that you might have a class with? No way. I mean, they are pretty cool. They have a really unique quirk. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You'll probably get to see it soon at the sports festival. Where we all get together and get to show off our quirks and powers and stuff. It's gonna be really good. Now, it is raining today, so I hope they don't cancel it. Though, knowing Mr. Izawa, he wouldn't cancel it. He'd make us perform in the rain. Well, he's all cozy in his sleeping bag. Anyway, you did get a new uniform and everything, right? Not like your hero costume, but like your actual like gym uniform type stuff. Oh, you did. It's a bit big. Hmm. That's unfortunate, but luckily for you, you have a friend who's good at sewing. Your measurements are still the same, right? I should still have them somewhere here. Oh yeah, I kept them. I keep everybody's, um, just in case, you know. We, why don't we just redate them just to be safe, yeah? Sorry. I'm not gonna keep my voice down a bit. But we could retake your measurements and stuff and I could it to better fit you before the sports festival later. No, yeah, I have a free period here soon, so it's not a big deal. You can just own me with maybe, like, you know, a date or a snack or something sometime. Right. Yeah, like a hangout session, you know, and I can tell you more about the school. Okay. Well, you need a bag for notes? have pink, pink, and, uh, pink. Pink, good choice. Here you go. So. Let's just go ahead and see if I can get some of your measurements real quick so I can get started. After class, of course. Well, you don't carry all this stuff in your backpack. You never know what you're going to need. I always have to be prepared. Whether it's a fashion emergency, a hair emergency, a makeup emergency, a tailoring emergency, I gotta make sure I have everything. And my stress bomb, because things here can definitely get stressful. Yeah. 
go. This is my tailor notebook where I keep measurements and such. It's for training later. Me and Sue are working for our like running time and everything for the yeah, for the event later. Realistically, she's keeping me in line. I tend to uh, hop out of line, if you know what I mean. Too many. I just need to get like your arm, your chest, neck measurements, waist and legs, okay? Yeah, since it's like a jumpsuit, I just need to make sure we get all those. So not too many and I'll compare them to the other measurements in case I'm a little off since we're gonna do this in class. But if you could just stick out your arm for me. We should be okay for like at least ten minutes. Five, six, eight. Yeah, next door. Green. around your arm here. Oh, thanks. You're sweet. I'm glad we get to spend more time together. I've been wondering how you've been like in school.
someone with me? They scared you. I'm sorry, it doesn't really sound like too many people here. Do you mind me asking what they look like? Uh, yeah. No, yeah, that makes sense, actually. Uh, their bark is worse than their bite. <laughs> They're actually quite sweet, if you ask me, but they like to portray a different image. It's Bakugo, yeah. Explosive temper, bright blonde hair, spiky. Yeah. You grow to like them. Get a little close, is that okay with you? Alright. There we go. And green. We're gonna go ahead and get your chest measurement. So I just have to get a little close to your chest. Oops. Yeah, just hold still here. Okay, yeah. And while I'm here, let me get your waist. Okay. Good. Almost done. I'm just gonna get the inseam and outseam of each leg, and we should be good to tailor your outfit. Okay. Like I said, we didn't need too many for this. Just a bit, and I'll make sure it fits you better. Was it feeling a little long or just a little big? Okay. Yeah, we can hem that up for you. All right. Hold out your leg to the side. They're just like readers, but well, you like that? You know what? I actually have another one if you want to match me. Your bag looks like it's lacking in keychains anyway. Yeah. I have a few. This little bunny, this cute little keychain of little piggies, this little bear, this little person, or this little bunny owl. Yeah, whichever one you want. You'll just think of me when you have it, right? So, yeah, you can have that. Mm
throat. Are you feeling okay? I'm pretty good at spotting when something's wrong with my friend. But yeah, friends. We're friends by now, right? We spend a lot of time together and we've gotten pretty close. And I love having new friends. So. Do you want to play with my blobfish? I've named him Blobby. He helps me feel better. Squishy, squishy, squishy. Yeah, you're nervous about the event later. It's really not that big of a deal, but... Um, what if I brushed your hair? You have very pretty hair, and sometimes some of that little personal attention helps me relax. Yeah. You want some gum too? Oh, don't worry, I have tons. Well, like I said, every time I bring out gum, all my friends at class want a piece. And I can't leave anyone out, so I always bring a double gum. You can have one here. There's a couple. Yeah. If you want me more, just let me know. You said you weren't feeling well. Do you mind if I take a look at your eyes? Just to make sure you're not getting sick. Look right here. Mm. Looks good. Let me check the other eye. Hmm. Good news, you're not dying. <laughs> I'm gonna have you follow this light with your eyes only, okay? Yeah, you remember this from last time? Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, you look good. Go ahead and brush your hair. You don't mind if I play with your hair? Okay. It's so pretty, Nick. We love the color. Always relaxes me to have my hair brushed too. I'm glad I got out. Anytime you want someone to play with your hair, I'm your girl. 
I love taking care of my friends. You know what we should do sometime? I love dancing. What if we also like went and sang and danced like a karaoke room? Can we get Sue to go and some of the other girls? It'd be so fun. Okay. I'll talk to them later. It smells so good with shampoo to use. I'll have to try that. a bit better. Okay. Looks like that's the bell. I gotta run. I'm gonna go work on your measurements and your uh, tailoring. Bye. Why don't we meet back in front of this classroom and let's say an hour? See you then.